Water, soil, and air. The symphony of nature's voice guides our unwavering dedication. Amidst the array of environmental challenges we face today, technology emerges as a beacon of hope for a sustainable future. Now it's time to open a one-of-a-kind toolbox. This cutting-edge robotics project of the Technical University of Munich, in collaboration with Hyundai Motor Europe, delves into the realm of environmental robotics as a promising solution. In this first installment of our documentary series, we're taking the first steps into a new and exciting future. Innovation for nature, from Staria to Svan. The goal of SVAN is to make robots useful for the benefit of the environment. So these robots often they have very specific functionalities and the users have very specific requests or what they want to do and SVAN should act as the bridge between those worlds. Our story begins at TUM, the Technical University of Munich, where a transformation is about to unfold. The arrival of the Staria marks the beginning of a groundbreaking collaboration between TUM and Hyundai. A collaboration that seeks to reimagine the role of robotics in protecting our environment. I think in the future, humans and robots will yeah, like seamlessly, more and more seamlessly, work together as a team. We will see already today these borders basically vanishing more and more, and that's also research we are actively working on within the SVAN project. What exactly is the SVAN? In a nutshell, the SVAN empowers individuals and experts to protect the environment with ease. With the SVAN project, we want to work with interdisciplinary teams of environmental scientists and social scientists, and of course, as roboticists, to then develop solutions that are really focused on what the environment actually needs. Its versatile toolbox of specialized robots can be remotely accessed by all, regardless of robotics expertise. The project's major goal is to establish a satellite lab accessible to global experts, even from their homes. These adaptable robots perform tasks like sampling, aerial observations and underwater measurements, reducing the need for human presence on site. You can think of it as the central hub where all these communications are rooted. Here, within the halls of TUM's Munich Institute of Robotics and Machine Intelligence, a team of experts have leveraged their expertise to modify the Staria, giving the vehicle a new life. At the heart of this invention lies the SVAN, a project born from research conducted by robotics experts, with initial funding provided by the Dobinec Technical Foundation. This innovative creation will significantly impact our understanding of the environment for the future. Equipped with a variety of aerial, ground and underwater robots, the Staria will serve as a central command post for these machines, seamlessly working together to combat environmental challenges with unprecedented ease. As we conclude this first chapter of our documentary series, we are left with many questions. How will the SVAN operate through treacherous terrain? Will it have an impact on the natural world? How will these robots develop over time? Environmental robotics, exemplified by the SVAN, hold the key to a future where humanity and nature coexist harmoniously. What will it unlock?